And the whole purpose of what we were doing was trying to prevent nuclear war, to prevent and transform the world. So the, open, the, the organizing metaphor, which is what I would share in these um, uh, meetings which, where people would give us money, was that the nuclear arms race is like two little boys standing knee deep in a room full of gasoline. And one holds seven matches, and the other one holds 11 matches. And um, that they're not paying a lot of attention to the fact that one match into the, the gasoline is going to blow up the whole room anyway. And the way most people were trying to deal with it at the time was to rearrange the mix of matches, to equalize them. And that was called arms control. And it didn't seem to us to be exactly, since the Americans had 30,000 weapons and the Soviets had 25,000 nuclear weapons, it didn't seem to us that that was going to do the trick, uh, just to change the match. And there were clearly mixes of those matches that were more volatile or dangerous than other mixes. If one side got too big an advantage, that was true. But our whole thing was not to rearrange the numbers of matches that the little boys were holding, but to drain the gasoline from the room. And that was how I talked about transformation. In other words, to change the environment or the context or uh, was the way that we talked about it. And our job was to, to drain gasoline from the room. And we saw that. Now, it was a big vision for an organization like ours. And from, that, from the very start, we were transformative in terms of that was an overall vision.